As a bass player, uh, the first thing about groove is getting rhythm in you and getting the rhythm out in the air. And uh, that's going to happen in your body when you groove. If I play a groove, you can see my whole body's kind of got a pulse in it. I'm no dancer, but you, could, you can get the idea. And if I, it's only going to get better if I move behind a kit. See, I'm playing that same groove. It's all in the neck, you know. You, you always see every bass player always got that neck movement. But if I do it behind here, I'm only going to internalize that even more in me. It's just going to, it seats that groove in you deeper. And I think it'll definitely help when you go to play with the drummer. trying to internalize this time in us by just doing this bodily action here and playing along with it it's kind of separating our mind the whole piano thing and I believe uh, it gets that uh, that beat into you actually when you walk away you'll feel this pulse inside you one thing that's really important is working on different tempos uh, sometimes I find myself I always kind of gravitate towards one tempo because it's comfortable and that's uh, that's not good so you want to try your grooves in all sorts of different tempos But you want to work on all those different tempos. Don't just do like I do a lot, where I'll end up on this. Comfortable, comfortable. You're really not gaining anything from that. I mean, the, the act of doing it, you're, you're going to gain something. But try to make sure you work through different tempos. things too when you're doing this is try to record yourself. You'll see we got mics all over the kit here and everything. I mean, tape don't lie. Uh, when you record yourself and you listen back, more times uh, than not you'll be like, ooh, you know, so it's the best truth indicator you could get. So I would uh, strongly suggest that. And uh, most important of all, you don't have to get behind the kit and play the bass and drum at the same time. Just we're trying to get some time in you. It's only going to help when we get into more intense stuff about slapping. You know, whether it's a hi-hat, just grooving, moving your body, tapping your foot. That's the whole name of the game here. We're just trying to get a pulse inside you. It'll only help your